Hello everyone and uh, welcome again to another video about a product I received as a gift. Yeah, this is a gift right here. It's this mouse pad uh, featuring like an anime character on it. Uh, so I really didn't buy this myself, but this was a gift and I've already opened it and taken it out of its original mail pack and then opened up this package, but I'm going to go ahead and do a quick review on it. Uh, and thanks Steven for the gift. This is a really nice pad. Thank you. Okay. So, here we got a standard mouse pad. It's like the size you would typically buy like at Walmart or any other place like that. Um, the design is a custom design. It is from a place called cowcow.com. And that's the invoice over there. But... Uh, you can custom make mouse pads, uh, coffee cups, t-shirts, whatever you like. Uh, you can create custom prints of, of many different products. And I'll probably check out cowcow.com at some other point just to look at the various products that they carry and the various products that uh, are able to be customized. I know the playing cards and the mugs and the t-shirts and the mouse pads and even the wall clocks look pretty freaking cool. But anyway... I get to this product. It's a very good product uh, as far as mouse pads go. It's got the kind of the slick surface so that way you can uh, run run your mouse across the surface without it really getting stuck anywhere. Or, you know, so it has a, a less friction than other surfaces. But on the back, of course, it's kind of like textured. I kind of lift that and point at an angle. Yeah, it's kind of textured. The back of the pad, I guess, this is so that way it won't slip. Uh, if you're like, you know, using it on a slick desk or a slick surface. Uh, this is pretty typical of like what you get at Walmart, Target, or any other store. Which isn't bad because uh, we all need some kind of like, you know, friction surface on the back so that way it won't go slipping and sliding everywhere. Because, you know, you got to be moving your uh, mouse around for different things and functions on your computer. But this is a really good pad, you know, front and back, and the print is absolutely awesome. Uh, it's got, like, this blonde character on it. She's, like, a little as V, an anime character. Not her, she, I'm not sure who she is, but uh, she's wearing, like, some kind of, like, scale mail or something like that. It's kind of revealing, like, uh, you know, her, her shirt's kind of open, and she's a little revealed. And by the looks of it, too, she's not wearing any pants, but... You know, all in all, it's a great mouse pad uh, if you like, you know, like anime and edgy type stuff. This is a really nice, uh, really good pad. And the surface, of course, is just great the way how you would find any other pad. Also, too, I'm not sure how good it would come out in the video, but the fidelity and the detail of the image itself came out really clear, even though these are custom printed images. Um, you know, the, the fidelity came out just as good as if it was printed off of printer or even better uh, than some of cheap-in uh, printers. But um, all in all, yeah, I'd have to give that this mouse pad is really good. The print is really good. Uh, you know, even, even just the design of the character is really likable, or at least I like the design of the character a lot. There, there's a lot of things that are, are pretty good about it, but... Um, yeah, this is definitely a place, too, that if you want any other custom character prints or you just want to put something wacky on a, on a coffee mug, like a picture of David Icke, I'm not even sure if anyone out there who's going to watch this will even know who that is. But, you know, it, it's a good place, and this is a nice gift, but all I need now is like a desk and a mouse because I don't have either of them. I just work off a, a laptop with a touchpad, which isn't the most ideal in many situations because a lot of times you want that extra mouse instead of just wearing out your touchpad. Um, of course, I would need a desk or something, which I don't have a space for a desk, but, you know, maybe a convertible desk. I've seen some, like, on different catalogs and even online that are convertible desks. They, they almost look like they're about the size of, like, ironing boards, and they can fold, not like an ironing board, but, like, fold where the big part or half of it folds down to one side and the other half of the desk is just kind of there and it's sitting on top of like this um, platform of like drawers or something like that. Uh, that. That would be pretty good. But this is a really nice print and I just want to say thanks again. Um, this is really nice. The color, the fidelity, 
the texturing front and back. I'm definitely going to be ordering more stuff from them at some point in the future. Uh, thank you for all watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll leave you with one last look at close up of different points. Okay, let's get a look at her face there. She has like, I don't know, like some kind of like little West V nose or something like that. She has her hand on her hip right there. And she's wearing no pants by the looks of it. And she's pretty exposed. Alright, that's it. Um, thank you guys. I'll see y'all later. Peace out.